Hello everyone, my name is Jack Firefox, and today I'm back bringing you the Iron to Master series, part two. Now, in the last series, we won a couple more games. We went up a division, and today we're going to play a couple more and go up a division, hopefully. That would be absolutely wonderful. So let's go switch on to the game client. Here we are, We've got our account right here, and a suggestion that was made to me by a viewer was that I should pick up Mordekaiser. They want to see some Mordekaiser gameplay, so we're going to go ahead and pick up Mordekaiser. Now, I will say that Mordekaiser is not a pick into any matchup type of character. He is a very uh, counter pick oriented character, not necessarily counter pick, but you don't want to first pick Mordekaiser and then find yourself in a situation where you're going against a range poke top lane in which Mordekaiser is most definitely weaker against. Um, he's definitely weaker against kiting char characters that can kite him around. He, you want like, uh, you, you especially want compositions where there's a few more melee characters than there are range characters because Mordekaiser would just get you know, kited to death. Now, we're going to lock in and get right into it. Alrighty, so now we're at our first champ select. Looking good. Alright, it only took us two minutes to find this one this time around. Now, top lane wise, we could hover Mordekaiser and give it a, give it a thought as we wait. <clears throat> so as always since I hate this character very very much I am going to get rid of Fiora I feel like this is a very understandable top ban I don't feel like very many people are going to have an issue with this top ban uh, going through this series uh, I think most people would agree that never seeing Fiora is probably a good thing but who knows? Let me know in the comments. <laughs> oh, they've banned the Mordekaiser. I am sorry, dear viewer. But it's okay. We'll work it out. Have Jack's jungle. So what are they going to pick into Jack's jungle? I do wonder. Ah, oh, they picked Riven. Well, now the Mordekaiser ban doesn't make as much sense. <laughs> so let's think this one through. We have Malzahar, Lucian, Riven, Tom Kench. We have Jax, Lux, Misfortune. We need some frontline. We need something that deals with Riven. Thinking. Renekton. Thinking definitely, definitely leaning Renekton here. Should be a satisfying game. I mean, Renekton W removes. Uh, so if you guys don't know how this matchup works, once I stack my Fury, my W can remove Tom Kench's shield. So it doesn't matter. How much HP he shields, my W will instantly remove the shield, which makes this matchup a lot better. <laughs> and then I do have Armor Shred on E, and I do think I might build a Bork. All right. And we're in the game. Perfect. Yo, what the heck? No, Blue and Summer. What? No, my stream's not going to be that long. I'm just doing an I. 
<laughs> Welcome to the stream. Much appreciated. I'm doing an iron to master's climb. Hello, blue and summer. Summer and blue. You're getting rated anyways. I appreciate it. Appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Doing, I'm doing a, say hello to YouTube. I'm doing the Iron to Masters climb on YouTube here. Welcome, welcome, y'all. Welcome, welcome. But yeah. Oh. <sighs> I'm really trying to make sure I don't lose any of these early on games. Right now we're against Tom Kench top, playing as Renekton top, Jack's jungle into Ramus jungle, Lux into Riven jungle, or sorry, Riven mid, and then MF Belkaz versus Malzahar L Lucian. I'm going to pick up Q. I'm going to go ahead and remove his bone plating. Stack up Fury. I must apologize to my viewers for putting them through the league. It's not that bad, I swear. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. Okay. It's a good trade. Ouchies. Alright, we want to avoid the tongue licks as much as possible, so we're just going to use the minions here. Hey man, chill. We can go for a trade here, we're a level ahead. That kills him. Liggity split. That's what we call a disrespect in the lane. As soon as I get a level advantage, I press it. It's very important to do so. And now that he doesn't have TP, our goal should be to shove this lane. Now this Ramus is also doing something extremely dumb. And he will also die for this, for his sins. <laughs> and so now we're gonna go back with tons of gold in hand and we might even go ahead and go Eclipse here Eclipse is very good into this matchup so it's an, it's an all around general good item gives us a shield for better trading does percentage max HP if I remember right yes sir does 8% bonus physical damage and grants you Yes, yes, yes. Hello, manager. I'm in call. Can't hear you. Ah, got you. No problem. Do, 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 do. Just gonna keep poking him with Qs in between the minions so that he can't Q us back. Nice. Gonna let it push. Gonna drink a pot. Make sure we stay healthy. Probably gonna go for an in here as soon as we thin out the wave. We don't want to fight with too many minions in the way. Oh my god, the alarm popping off. Not like this. So we just freeze here. And so he's either gonna have to decide to fight us. Or he's gonna recall. I think he might recall here. Just gonna slow push. Top lane's all about freezing, slow pushing, controlling the wave. It's become the match carry alarm. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we're 100% carrying this game. We're going to probably be carrying the games uh, for a little while here. 
at least. Until we reach about like diamond, that's when we're gonna start learning together, so to speak. Okay, Ramus is bot side. Probably put a ward up soon. Alright, that was a good trade. I'm gonna go ahead and get some deep vision. Oh, there's Ramus. This Ramus is giga dead. Alright, perfect. Not bad, not bad. Jack's gonna get us some grubbies. Oh, we already got one. That's gonna help us increase our damage against towers. Just gonna walk up, remove the bone plating. Maybe let this push back into us. We're honestly just waiting for items. Eclipse is a good bump. Big chillin'. Very much last hit. So we've denied him the cannon. This is all... This So like... Our, what we're thinking right now is that how can we deny him the most golden experience? And right now it's letting our minions kill, be killed by his minions, which means he's missing out on it, both XP and gold-wise. And so we have tons of gold. It's his turn in the lane. So we can think about this as, a, as similar to a fighting game where there are turns. Right now it's his turn because he has a lot of minions, so we can't really fight him in between all his minions. Because it, it would be bad to fight on somebody's turn. So we need to thin out the wave so that it can be our turn. Dodge that. Alright, so we've thinned out the wave, so now our now it's our turn. He's walking down mid. We can keep pushing top. And so now he's just going to keep on missing XP and gold. Okay. Okay. Oh. He's dead. Flashed, pop the Dominus. Oh, hello. I am dead. <laughs> Unfortunate. So we're going to pick up Eclipse. Let's see here. It looks like the threats are AD oriented. So we're going to go ahead and go plated steel caps to avoid that level of damage. And I go ahead and pick a this cooldown reduction. Oh, that's not what I meant to pick. I meant to pick up a pink ward. After we killed him, probably should have walked away. I wasn't too, too aware. That's my bad. Good job. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Alright, so they're taking drag. Not a great situation. But we don't have TP. Oof. Not looking too, too great for our team here. Oh, nice. 
Jax for the win. No, we missed the cannon. The look. Gonna max E because of the changes that happened to Renekton. His E is better than his W for leveling. Okay, he's gonna stay. We're gonna kill him. Perfect. Easy dive. Go ahead and push this tower. Kill these minions. Back up a little bit. Kill this. Avoid the Ramus. Preferably the Font. And then we're just gonna back. And then we're gonna work Grab our plated steel caps and we're gonna to work towards our next item. Probably gonna be Sundered Sky. And so we're gonna work on getting our pink ward out. So good pink ward spot is here. This is somewhat okay, but not the best. And then another really good pink ward spot is like over here. But that's more for mid lane. A really good deep ward is here. You could put a pink there, and most people don't check that bush for pinks. This guy is free. We're gonna trade, we're gonna fight. Okay. Took one. Oh, she missed. That's unfortunate. He's got a good stun angle. They kill him. Perfect. Oh. Alright, we stunned him so he couldn't jump over the wall. And unfortunately, the Jax died. That's okay. This Tom Kench, through our efforts of making sure that this Tom Kench has not gotten any XP or gold, he is two levels down and is almost an item behind. I mean, he isn't at his first item, but I'm going to say he's close to finishing his first item. Since tank items are very cheap. But I actually don't know what he's building. I'm gonna push this really quick. Ah. I really want that tower gold. Give it to me. Alright. Okay, he didn't press. Now we oh. Now we chill. Recall. Go go ahead and buy a couple more components towards our item. And screw like go running down the lane. <laughs> alright, alright. Okay. This game's looking really, really good. The only thing that's going anywhere for them is the fact that they have one drag and one grubby. Okay. Our Lux is being chased. Are we doing this? That's 
No bueno. He's dead. Thing. And now he dies. That was good. Went ahead and take took down the ribbon, which was the priority target there. And then we killed the Ramus on the side. And then Tom Kench was our last priority target. It was unfortunate that Jax didn't kite it out, because I think he could have potentially survived. I'm gonna have to run. Be over the wall. They can't follow too easily. They also can't contest the dragon for that. They could contest this potentially. I'm gonna go ahead and pink it just to make sure. We have vision over it. Okay. Okay. Okay, this is a good kill. And he's dead. Perfect. So our team should be getting this or this, please. Either one would be fantastic right now. This game's lasting a little bit longer than my liking. Bad Ignite. He's looking to eat me. Alright, perfect. We get our Sundered Sky. We can work towards our Sterex, maybe. More survivability. Or we can work towards Spear Chosen for more spamming of abilities. With how far ahead we are, I feel like keeping ourselves alive going to be the better option of the two. Especially with the amount of burst they have. They also have Malzahar, so a Malzahar ulti could leave me very vulnerable if I don't have any anti-damage. Also, when Sterix pops, I believe we do get Tenacity, but that could have changed some time ago. Oh, we already get Tenacity for just having the item, so that's perfect. So I think I'll make it so that Malzahar's ulti doesn't last as long on us, which is always a plus. I'm going to shimmy our way towards mid. This person's dead. Nice. We are behind Riven. I'm gonna go in on this. Never mind. Jax did not decide to follow up. Perfectly fine. Riven's gonna potentially kill our boy here. Now we're okay. Go ahead and walk into enemy jungle real quick. Look for this ram mist. Probably over here. So we should probably take. Oh no! Never mind. Not gonna ye? Oof. Oof. <laughs> That's too funny. Riven killed our MF off screen. That person's Giga dead. Stun him a little longer so that Velkaz true damage can kill him. Doing really, really good right now. I'm 
Okay. Now we can back off. Not a good angle to stay. I can go ahead and buy my item. Get my Steric Gauge. Then we can work towards our next item. Which now, I'm thinking, is going to be Death Stance. Yeah. I think we go back top. We can threaten top while they threaten bot. We have mid inhib cracked, so that's going to be automatically pushing. And we're fine here. Unfortunately, we don't have TP to take advantage of the fact that we could push, and then maybe TP to help our team. But should be more or less okay. Though this ribbon is terrorizing my, uh, my bot lane. And unfortunately, the Tom Kench has killed my mid lane. Oh, they are all dead. This may just be a Baron angle for them. They're not going Baron. This is fine. Looks like Tom Kenj is still there. Malzahar is there. So we're just going to push this. Got Conqueror stacked. It's always good. It's hiding for me over here. Okay. Tom Kench over here. Okay. Pop into Dominus. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, we should go Baron. Should do it anyways. With or without jungle, should be fine. Probably like to push a little bit of top wave and then recall and reset. Perfect. So we're gonna go top, we're gonna push that out a little bit, and then we're gonna reset. Perfect. Gonna go this, gonna sell this, we're gonna buy this. Is it bad whenever a person gets caught out? All I hear is Half Life Scientist screams in my head. <laughs> no, not bad at all. I love that. That's that's beautiful. I love that for you. <laughs> I love that for you. This is a beautiful thing. Never never stop being you, fam. Oh, our Lux needs, our Lux needs our help. You could say she's even caught. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Okay. Hello, Malzahar. Pleasure, pleasure meeting you here. Unfortunately, I couldn't break your shield with my E. You're dead. Alright, we're chilling, we're chilling. Probably just gonna pop the Dominus and end the game here. Okay. Nothing this Riven can really do at this point. Perfect. GG. Even though we can't really talk to our teammates. Because I turned that off. No allow. No 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 talking to teammates. Teammates are just NPCs. They're part of the game.
All right, so we're going to go ahead and give it to the Jax. Not terrible pathing. Played it. Played it reasonably well. And then we're going to do a little scoreboard check. We got ourselves 28 LP. The stats are looking good. Good, good, good. Graphs. Runes. Oh, we got a lot from Triumph. A lot of HP from Triumph. Perfect. All right. Now I just click next. And we lock in. Yeah, so see, this is like a terrible position for Mordekaiser, is being first pick. So we're going to try to swap with somebody. There we go. Perfect. So now we hover Mordekaiser. And we see who we end up going against. Obviously, we ban our most hated character, our most mortal enemy, Fiora. Our team comp so far is a little weird with Yatsuo ADC. Okay, we go for Hyper Carry Jinx, maybe. Okay, we're thinking about it. Senaban is good. Senaban's always good. Hecarim jungle, not too bad as long as the enemy team doesn't have too much CC. Hecarim's very susceptible to hard CCs. Er, da, 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 da. Okay, they went Jinx. Jinx is very easily abusable lane early on. Maybe picking some early game stuff. Okay, so that, so far they have a Poppy. That's a brand jungle probably. Gonna go ahead and swap out again. Because we don't want to get counterpicked. Now I understand that right now these are lower ranks. But I'm going to play every game as if it was, you know. Or at least try, you know. Sometimes I might eagle myself. Okay. This isn't actually too, too bad of a lane. Like... Percentage HP, percentage HP. This one's going to be really annoying for us, but these two are going to be very easy for us, and this one too as well. So we're going to go ahead and go Mordekaiser. Like I said, three melees equals pretty good game for Mordekaiser. I'm not a huge person for the... I mean, the Revitalize could be good because of the shield. Usually like to go overgrow for the permanent HP. Tenacity's good here. Last stand. Triumph. All great stuff. All great stuff. We're gonna get second win though. As well. Gonna grab the good old reliable obliterate. So with Mordekaiser, you only want to so a little, a little tip and trick for Mordekaiser especially is going to come down to his ultimate and how you level your abilities. So with Mordekaiser, you want to level your Q, E, W. You only want to level your R once. The reason being is because all leveling up your alt does is reduce its total, uh, its total cooldown which isn't as good as increasing your damage or survivability. Mm, if only it had hooked a little earlier, it would have worked out. Also, when trying to do damage to enemies, try to see if you get some isolated damage as it will incur increased damage to them. Want to make sure that we interrupt his Q with our... Perfect. Uh, we kind of ruined these minions. Drink a pot. Walk with him. Perfect. We 
we are chilling. Perfect. Jack is back. Yes, I am. Back at it again. And we are starting very good. Even though we were behind, we went ahead and just walked at him and killed him. The good old reliable. So that shows you that even if you disconnect, your enemy opponent can still mess up at this rank. But yeah, I mean, it's the lowest rank. What can we, what can we expect? I'm going to definitely try to push past this quickly, quickly. Man, I sound really autistic. <laughs> I don't know how many times I've said this. Oh, good dodge. Gonna push one more wave. And we are out. So here we want to build Rylai's. Probably gonna build the blasting one first. And then we're gonna build boots so that we can't be easily walked away from. And we're just gonna walk back to lane. Our Ari mid is doing semi okay. They gotta kill mid. Pretty good, pretty good. And we make it back before the minions crash. We lost one minion's worth of XP. Alright, we got all that. That wouldn't have been an, a worthwhile trade. Just throwing that out there. Alright, pink ward here. And then ward here. And then uh, another pink ward spot could have been here. So we're just going to put a regular ward. And then we're going to hit that to see if the enemy jungle is here. I somehow ruined myself and missed caddy for that. But it's okay. We got vision. And he missed caddy too. So not the end of the world. Just got to make sure we know where this brand is. We do not want to take brand damage. That is, it is probably the only thing that could really kill us right now. See, we got Brand on a ward. We stay just outside of vision range. Hello. Okay. Okay, we're fighting. Perfect. No need to full commit there. We blew his flash. I could have chased after the kill, but there's no point to it because then we'd miss more. More minions. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Good trade. out with the W. Looks like bot lane got messed up. Tristana is getting messed up. Put Q here. Just have him permanently under tower. Decent poke.
want to punish him if he walks up for any of these minions so we can deny him more creeps. We already garnered ourselves a pretty chunkable CS lead. Pretty chunky CS lead is what I meant to say. Level up E. Push. Grab the one plate. Minions will take care of that. There we go. Now we recall. Unfortunately, we could not finish item. But getting components can be just as good. She is dead. Oh, maybe? Oh my goodness. The plays are coming out for my teammates. Let's go. Fantastic stuff, boys. But yeah, that's the power of having a good top side. Just being a strong lane in general is going to help your team just win the game a lot easier. Because as you can see, we got triple grubbies. Means more plates. Means more XP for our Hecarim. Always, always good. And now we freeze. Freeze and slow push. And now he has to walk up to get any minions. And so in overextending himself, he may die. There we go. Oh. I meant to just hit it with Q. Just to secure it. There we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Don't want to use E. He can soak a little bit of XP, but no gold for him. Don't want to waste cute either. Mm, this brand could be on. Okay. Isolate the brand. Yeah, the brand was so many levels behind us that it, it just wasn't irrelevant what he could do to us anymore. When we're same Z levels, it's a problem. When we're not the same level, if I isolate him, he is 100% dead. And this is for most jungles. That's why Mordecai is very scary. And killing that brand there makes it so that he doesn't secure grubbies just yet. Oh, this is good. Oh, I missed my E. That was bad. It was a good trade nonetheless, but it could have turned into a kill. Okay, stopped his back. Make him miss more CS. Push a little harder. Potentially get another plate here. Gotta watch out for his alt though. So we're just gonna hit it just enough for the minions to get it for us. And then we're gonna leave. Probably gonna sell this uh, health pot. 
Sell. My Rylize. Let's see. They have quite a decent amount of magic damage. But the threat is the Jinx. So we're going to go ahead and go Plated Steel Caps. And then we're going to work towards our Leandries. Should be our Lex. Our next item. Pick up a pink ward for vision control. And then we're going to put that pink ward potentially over here for deeper vision. So now we have more control over top. Looks like Scion went bot. Our only real option here is to keep pushing top. Potentially even go for the Rift Herald. Brand is here. Alright, so like I said, I'm gonna level this up. He's dead. Now we do Rift Herald. That was a little risky, but I don't think he had flash. Rift Herald's really good here. One more key should do it. Now we got Rift Herald. This Scion doesn't have all. He's just gonna walk away, that's okay. No! I think we take this with Rift Herald. <clears throat> I think this brand might get top the first tower first. Perfect. What? No. Okay. Perfect. Keep leveling other abilities instead of alts. Make sure to do that. That's very important. Big. Now we get the advanced recall. We can go buy ourselves the component haunting guys. Then we can look towards maybe going bot and securing ourselves drag. <laughs> can you stop squeaking the toy? I have a dog in the room. So I apologize if you hear the squeaking of the toy. What a goober. This guy is most likely dead. Perfect. Killing her would be nice. But it's probably not going to happen. work towards the bot lane tower now. <laughs> the dog went excited. Dog has the zoomies. Not again. Mm, not an exciting lane state to be in. Okay. Alright, this should be okay then. This should be 
a tower. There's a poppy. That's not good. Wait, she's right here. Oh. No way. That's crazy. Maybe we can get her? Nah, it doesn't look like it's gonna be it. Maybe. That's not good. Do not have all team. Not bad. I'm gonna go ahead and build this and work on this. Huge items. Oh no. Akron, please. You can fight this. Okay. Akron going crazy with it. Tristana going cra- oh. Tristana going crazy with it. We could go for this? Potentially? I think we go for this. Big man. Okay. No, no, no. <laughs> oh my god. So many distractions. Alright, we got this. This is a big... This is a big grab. It's not gonna be item though. Probably gonna have to work towards it. Get ourselves a bigger shield. Getting Jinx here would be good. There's a big shutdown. Unfortunate for you. Thank you for the goal. Big shutdown. Now we work towards Jack Show. Making us absolutely unkillable especially if we pick up the <coughs> magic resist side of it first considering our magic resist is lower okay Brother, all 
Okay. 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 We have a shutdown. We can't die. We recall. The one thing we can't do is die right now. If we get Jack Show, we're gonna be unkillable. And then we can work towards maybe like. We already have innate magic pen. Could get another amount of magic pen. Could go for a void bloom or void staff. Down outrun me. Mr. Yellow Swag, you are dead. Mm, nothing much to do here. Probably should pick up Bot Wave. Bot Wave's already pushing to the enemy, so we want to make sure Bot Wave is pushing. Get the scuttle, walk it towards Bot. Keep ourselves strong. Never stop CSing. Hey. What are you doing? Mr. Dog. Please. Baby. What, are, what do you have in your mouth? Uh oh. Uh oh. oh that's okay. It was a bad fight for our team to take, but I'm pretty sure it's okay. Alright, we got Jack Show. Mm. Why are you ripping that apart? Dogs are so weird. Perfect. And now we need magic pen. Hey. Hey. What are you doing? Not the poster, please. Not the poster. Anything but the poster. Alright, here we go. We might catch these people. Mm You're dead. Alright. Jinx died before she could do anything. We're gonna get drag. It's all very good stuff. Fortunately, this fight was a little too far away from Baron, so we can't do Baron. But that is okay. Alright, now that we're at our last points, we work towards our all two. Okay. Okay. You 
are dead. Oh, that was very close. Very nice. Very perfect. But as you can see, the Jinx did no damage to us because we have a large amount of armor and magic resist. Escape. Nope. Nope, escape. Nope. No escape. Nope. No escape. All right, perfect. Good little pentakill there. Boom bada bing. Could be GG. Could be GG. Could be a good game. Perfect. We're gonna go ahead and recall over here. Make our move towards uh Void staff, pick this up. So now they don't have any magic resist against us. So we are chilling. Forty nine percent magic resist pen. We're huge. Wanna work towards getting this Baron? Oh, it looks like they're doing a desperate play. Perfect. Ooh. The E? Bonk. Cowards? <laughs> I like how he screams cowards, but he's the one that's running away. I wonder... Do 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 do... That was a mistake. Okay. Amazing. Perfect game. Dance. And that should be the game. End. What? Wait, how did we die? Oh, there we go. All right, perfect. Oh my god, we almost got two pennas that game. All right, let's go ahead and give it to our jungler once again. Not bad, not bad. Thank you for the stretch. Perfect game. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and go over here, 
75,000 damage. Good, good, good. View the advanced details. Nice, nice. Look at the graphs. Look at the runes. All great stuff. Alright, perfect. I think we have time for one more match. Depends on what they pick. Do, 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 do. Nefiri mid. Mmm. Thanks. I don't even want to continue that line of dialogue. What are they thinking? Oh, goodness. Really do have to pick an AP, don't we? Hmm. Could do Udir top. Udir top's doing pretty decent still. Could also... I mean, we need the AP. What are they thinking about getting? Let's see what they pick. What are you guys gonna pick? Come on. Pick, 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 pick. Pick a lane. Pick a champ. All right, perfect. It is Talon mid or Talon jungle. Okay, that's a nice uh, start with a flex pick. Two more picks. It's probably going to be bot lane. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna swap with Nefiri. Okay, hard lock on Nefiri, hard lock on Ramus. Huyoy. Yeah, see, this is what you would not like to see. Mm. We play Udyr, we're stuck under tower. If we play Karma, we're not. They don't really have front line. Karma, Karma could be good here. Go ahead and do the karma top thing. Yeah, it's a cheap shot. So we go comet for our extra damage. We go mana flow. Oh man, I totally forgot to do this. We go comet for damage. We go mana flow for mana. Transcendence to get more cooldown reduction. Gathering storm. More cooldown on alt. More cooldown. This this is very much so a cooldown oriented build in which you want to spam as many Qs as possible. All right, perfect. Q first, of course. This is a Teemo with Grasp, Ignite. All right, perfect, perfect, perfect. Ooh, it is a Talon jungle. I had a feeling it was. Walk this way. Thirty seconds until minions spawn. An idea is nothing until you fight for it. We have learned as All right, so the goal in this lane is to just CS, poke out the Teemo, get our build, 
and become the machine gun mid-range artillery <laughs> mortar. Oh, I see. I think we're gonna need to have to. Oh no, he's starting Raptors. Joe Rogan. <laughs> I like that name. Fiesta Furby. Seriously, these low ranks really do got some creative, creative names. As Ionia changes, so must I. Oh, y'all didn't see that. Okay. Just cue him over and over. Okay. Q spam. He to block damage. What a G. Good job. That was a very good dang. He saw the play, then he came for it. Oh no! Y'all didn't see that. Y'all didn't see that. That's unreal. I totally didn't do that. Alright. It never happened. Perfect. But YouTube will see it. YouTube sees everything. It's a good time to recall overall. Get Ionian boots. Start running back to lane. Just make sure to E yourself over and over again to make sure that you get to lane faster when you got characters that have speed. Okay. We do need to get some vision for potential ganks. It's not our turn, so we're just gonna back off. Every time comments up, want to use it to trade. There is in war. Last <laughs> Keep our HP up. Good hit. Play it slow. Looks like they're doing grubbies. Most likely doing grubbies. Oh. It looks like he is pissed? Or I'm not really too sure what just happened. 
It's going to reduce the cooldown of this. Ooh. Perfect. I'm going to go help this guy. Go help our good friend Joe Rogan over here. Oh, so now they heal. That's nice. Bruh. Let's recall. Let's buy... Looks like we're gonna have to buy this. Venus Codex got nerfed. Let's put more mana. Let's do a TP. Looks like this guy is dead. At least we got grubbies before then. Okay. No. That's so sad. Okay. Control the lane. We chill. Probably kill this backline real quick. Good auto on me. We have learned as much Okay. Nice. Probably screaming for jungle help. Jungle's bot. Big chillin'. That almost killed him. He's definitely backing, which means he is gonna be hurting for XP in a second here. Because his jungle is bot side. Maybe we could get this tower plate real quick. Just gonna increase just to get it because I feel like we're gonna miss it if we don't get it now. Oh, I should have remembered he put a fucking shroom in here. That's so annoying. Stops her back for a little bit. All right, got lost chapter. Got fiendish. Editing a review for. Dragon's Dogma 2, why aren't you playing it yourself? Uh, I hear that there's a lot of performance issues. And some people... I heard a review where somebody got stuck in the game. And is unable to do anything about it. Because you can't reload the save and stuff. So I'm just going to wait for a potential day one patch. And then start making a video series on it. But I wouldn't be streaming it anyways. I wouldn't be streaming it. I would be trying to do a Let's Play series on it, personally. And I know that sounds weird. It's like, couldn't you just do a Let's Play while streaming? But 
I'd honestly just be happier to take my crack at doing Let's Play, play Commentary solo. If that makes sense. A lot of hate on the game. I think it's somewhat warranted. All things considered, it's like really bad performance right now because of the uh, anti-pirating that they have. Which, you know, most people really don't like uh, that anti-pirating system because it really tanks performance a lot. But yeah, I'm sure it runs fine. I'm, I'm, just, I'm just trying to avoid the unfortunate happening to me. I'll probably play it, uh, probably just play it this upcoming uh, days off that I get. Oh, hello. Hello? Nope. None of that good, sir. Not today. Yum yum. Free food, yes. Very yum yum jungler. Big mistake on his part. That's not gonna hit. Oh, it's gonna hit. Alright, perfect. Alright, we got malignants done. Big. This is very big. Now we can work on getting Crypt Bloom. Or better hit, sorry, uh, Horizon Focus, then Crit Bloom. That's the order of operation. My spirit is an but yeah, I'm just waiting a little bit. Uh, I am hearing that there's quite a few streamers that are streaming it, and they're having like performance issues as well. Like, game works fine when, when not streaming. So I'm probably just going to record it, because recording doesn't require much like, to do. At least I don't think. I think streaming requires more than recording. But I could be wrong on that. Uh, but I do have my encoder working when I'm streaming. My like GPU encoder. So that has to make a bigger performance impact. <laughs> he can't even damage my shield. That's so unfortunate. Let's go for a vision. This is a pretty lazy ward. Alright, perfect. All right. This is a good dive. RAM issues. All graphics max. It's eight gigs of VRAM. Ah, that's tough. Yeah, I only have sixteen gigs. I'm thinking about building a new computer this year. It's going to be a Giga PC, one that will last the next 10 years. And boom. Okay, good GPU. Tank it easy. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Okay, okay, okay. I think this game is going very swimmingly. And it's just gonna end up being a win here. It's pretty straightforward. I don't really know if there's much tips I can give here. Other than spam abilities on karma. Don't do what I just did. You know, those type of things. Hello Pikachu, welcome to the stream. Posture. Am I leaning? Oh, I am leaning. Yeah. 
my chair will help me fix this. There we go. Push that forward. Gotcha, bitch. Nice. Stop him from burning. Should go. Oh, hello, Renata. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate that. <laughs> Why is it day at my house? Well, you see, I live in the great USA where it's daytime all the time because we're amazing. Cue in the America fuck yeah song, you know? All right, we got Horizon Focus. Big damage bonus. Big damage bonus. Oh, this this person's not dead. Holy. Oh, never mind. He somehow died. Uh, I think I'm going to go this way. I think this is the move. I mean... That tickled. Bye bye. Unfortunate for him. <laughs> we basically one shot anybody. Oh man. Phone, why? Why phone? Why must you torment me? Let's see. Mr. Assassin Jungler. Oh. <laughs> it was a prank, bro. It was a prank. 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 I'm trolling. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, I'm trolling. All right, I got I got a little little trigger happy there. And right, let's get some get more cooldown reduction. Why the fuck not? Or maybe yeah, MR. Magic pen, magic pen. Do we need magic pen? Not really. But I really like Crypt Bloom. It's also a really cheap pen item. I actually could have stayed alive there, and I totally into it. Totally into it. Whatever you just saw, don't do that. That's called egoing. It's a very bad. <laughs> you pee on my flag? No. Egoing, yes. It's when you think you are, you are. It's it's when you think you could take on a situation that normally wouldn't be good to take. Oh, hello. That was good. But yeah, that's what I what I that's what I call egoing. Is taking on a situation that is just not like normally feasible, but you still want to take it anyways because you think you're just better. I mean, I am better, but in a situation where I'm not better, that's just egoing. That could lead to a lot of deaths. Just as much as uh, not playing as aggressively as you could be could lead to losing. As Ionia changes, 
Oh yo, our CS per minute is going down. Can't stop CSing. You make me want to play this game and it's bad. What do you mean? Hello, Mr. Talon. Oh, hello, Mr. Timo. <laughs> They're just running away. Fight me. Okay. Boom. Oh, there's a Talon in the bush, huh? We just mosey on over here. Oh. I swear I saw a talon. Am I, am I, am I, am I seeing things? Hello. <laughs> oh my god. Owie, 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 owie. There we go. What have you missed so far? Well, I just walked up to this Teemo and made his life absolutely miserable. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I was like, wait, we need 50 more gold. And then my teammate just took a tower. And we have the 50 more gold. I'm gonna TP. I'm gonna TP. Take him, boy. Bye bye. Woo! Now that's exciting. Where are we at? Okay. She's up there. We take this mid tower though. I wanna play Teemo now? Wait, you wanna play Teemo after watching what happened to this man? You have a death wish. It's okay though, Teemo's actually really annoying. Okay, that was a decent flash. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and do Rabidons. <laughs> Nuclear shrooms. Oh, this talent's tilted. He went bot. He just said, like, fuck my team. Alright, we got this in him. I mean, technically, he actually did a good thing because he doesn't protect this, but he does get the gold here. And that would be a way to come back, is getting side plates, side gold, side lane golds in the towers. That the enemy team isn't paying attention to. Alright, we are close to Rabidons. We are 9 and 1. We are massive. Our shield shields us for a lot. <laughs> 
508 shielding. Holy. And the Fury just one shots that dude. Let's go ahead and. Hello. That's dead. That's dead. That's dead. Not the shroom damage, man. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Nope, not today. Oi. No. Oi. <laughs> Holy. A little too close. For comfort. Perfect. Got ourselves rabbit ons. Bye bye. Ah, the minion spawned literally in front of me. We're stacking damage. Kill that. Perfect. A little dance. Ah, we couldn't get the dance in. Alright. Absolutely banger game. go give it to joe rogan <laughs> what a g could you imagine if that's the real joe rogan that'd be so funny man i'd be weak to my knees Forty-three thousand damage one death for stupid reasons extra stats graphs runes Holy shit, Comet with 3,100 damage? My god. Alright. Perfect. Alright, alright. Let's go over here and... Alright. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Fuck you, phone. Uh, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Look at phone. Holy moly. <laughs> Chill out. Alright. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. I appreciate you a ton. If you enjoy the content, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. And hopefully with a little less phone going on. Bye-bye.